Hey guys, it's Toxic. Um, this is training video number 25, I believe. If not, then it's probably, like, you know, above. But whatever, you know. <laughs> Alright, so, um, this was the last trade we did in our video, where we traded our Space Trojan for Serenox Golden Chalice of Fame and a Crazy Bot 10,000. Our next completed trade, well, this was kind of just a trade with a friend, or fan, or whatever you want to call him. He sent me his, um... Minute Commando for fun. But um next we traded with RPG Steve. We gave we gave one Sword of the Eternal Abyss and one hyper laser gun for Tick Explosion, Festive Narwhal, and Blue Wistful Wink. Next we traded with Bait Hacks you. Now this one is bad now, but before when I did it, it was actually good. Now at the time Winter Conjurer was twenty five K. Now people are saying it's thirty. But it does seem like it's going to lower because the lowest price right now is twenty six thousand. So it could lower. And Purple Bubble Trouble at the time, I valued at 15. So with 25 plus 15, that was 40 for 40. Good demand. And it's a classic item. If you guys don't know me, I'm a fanatic about classic items. Like, I just love these so much. So he kind of got a little bit of value when at the time, or after the fact of the trade. And I got, you know, cool item. Next, we traded with the Liam. We gave our 2010 party cap for red, white, and starface. And Egg of Equinox Day. Now, I don't know why he did this, but he did it. He just sent it, and I did it. Next, we traded our Cuddly Koala for Shaggy and 10 Robux. It was a free 10 Robux. How could I not take that? <laughs> Next, we traded with Hawk Whorl. We traded our Festive Narwhal for a Putrid Green Head in a Jar. Now, this was 600 wrap. This was, like, 590 wrap. And this had a lower selling price by far, so I switched over, and I managed to pull a win out of that in two days. Um, next we traded with Bombastic Person. We gave our Noob Attack, Artemis Annihilation, and Blue Wistful Wink for Xeno Targeting Oculus. Now, this is one of the items I liked as a child. When I was playing, I was always like, oh my god, I'll never be able to get this. Despite me having a lot more than what this is worth, even back then, because this was a, always a stable like 1k item. Like, if you look, even now, sometimes it peaks over 2k, and then it goes right back down to 1k where it usually is. But yeah, that was a good trade on my part, I believe, because the, these two items are worth a wrap, and then this one, I would value at maybe 1.5 at times. But I used to love this item as a kid, and I could never actually afford it, because I always blew my money on, like, bigger limiteds. And um, I never had a chance to get this small item that I actually liked. Um, next, we traded our Shaggy for Blue Pocket Pal. I don't know. Like, I just woke up yesterday, and Spenny sent me this cool trade, and I'm just like, okay, let's do this. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Anyway, so right now, we have 105,944 wrap. Not bad. We have a Classic Fedora, Doom Bucket, Legit Fedora, Neon Green Hair, Mayday 2012. Um, tick explosion, hyper laser gun, Dino targeting, Oculus, blue was er, no not blue link, blue pocket pal. Wait, how's this 800? I just realized that it's probably hoarded. I'll look it up later. Um, we also have red, white, and starface, putrid green, head in a jar. We got Skatwelver boy, Earth Day 2010, and um, Egg of Equinox Day. Now people say this song's creepy, so I'm gonna switch it. I think it's pretty cool though. Whatever. It's just opinions. So we're going to take off the classic fedora today. And maybe... Okay, we're going to save this outfit. So we are going to remove one of the plain outfits. Also guys, if you don't know, what you can do right now is go to the t-shirt you want to save. Go back one. And since it's a transparent image, what you would do is you save it. Um, I'm going to make a new folder for this which is going to be vest. So we put this over in vest and we're going to put default. And basically what you want to do is then put that onto like the torso of a um, actual shirt. And then after the update you could put them onto colors like that and then match the skin tones which I think is going to be probably a little bit hard but I don't know. But yeah. Roblox just loves making our lives difficult. So we're going to replace this bland blue. So we're going to click update. Actually, I don't know if I want to update that. 
I saved a lot of the black ones. Hmm. What do we want to replace? I guess we could... We could get rid of this one. So update. <coughs> Alright, so since we updated that, we could move over to a new outfit. Diamond. With our limited edition diamond hoodie, but we're not wearing that today. What we're going to wear is the Xenotargeting Oculus. I never wore this, like... I never had this before. And, oh boy, d did I really want to get this. So that's pretty cool. That years later down the line, I managed to get something I've wanted for a while. Now, I'm gonna stop, like, going, oh my god. Um, I don't think the searching works with the... Roblox Plus right now, which sucks, cause now I have to now I have to go through forty something pages of hats just to find my classic fedora. Why can't it be all the way in the front? Cause it was a, cause I recently traded for it. I don't know why they had to make my life difficult and click through all this. And we're still clicking. And we're still clicking. Finally, okay. So we put that on. Does that look good? Eh. So we wasted all that time, basically. Hair. Let's look for the golden shaggy. I'm just gonna try to look like what people would look like back in the days for today. And, um, shirts. I have to go to my last page, and that's gonna be a lot of work. But I'll do it for you guys. I have a lot of ran random shirts that I bought, and I don't quite remember why. Okay, so back then people would have stuff like... This was very popular back then, I remember. Um, plain coat was kind of popular. Fear was very popular. When I made this count, I joined Fear and I did that stuff, because I like to sword fight. Um, let's see, is there anything that people would wear back then? So, basically, years down the line, I realized that CF Motors actually, you know, copied the default little shirt. So, these vests are very popular. They were always very popular. So, we are going to go look for maybe a black one, if I have one. Because I don't want to wear the one that says, like, you know, some little group. That's ended a while ago, I think. Um, golden tuxedo. This is why I think Roblox should have like a try it on feature. That way you don't fall for items that don't have transparent arms. This one has a band. Plus it's not the original mesh. This one has the original mesh. So we're gonna wear that I guess. And now we're gonna go all the way to the back of our items again to go get some old jeans. From forever ago. Right here. Now, this is what you would see people wearing either that or this. These two pants were actually pretty popular. So I guess we're gonna wear that, and for faces, we're gonna wear maybe Stare. I don't think Stare is that old, but hey, whatever. Just to, you know, bring a little bit of change here. Now we're gonna go to a Trade Hangout, and we are gonna play for a little bit. We're gonna see if we could find anyone to trade with. R15 makes this outfit look stupid. <sighs> but I gotta say that the shoes got cut off perfectly. <laughs> look at this, they actually look like shoes because they got cut off at the right area for the most part. Alright, cool. Why well, do I have a big forehead right here? Alright, we're gonna go into full screen for now while we look for people. Green Bandit Top Hat is a cool item. Good old item. I bought it originally and then I sold it for like 3k. And then I forgot this text and I'm like, oh my god! Uh, he doesn't even have a top hat. You don't have a top hat? 
Yeah, I don't think he has a top hat. What? Oh. Uh, no thanks. I don't want to downgrade my stuff, and I think that the do-it-yourself Dominus is probably projected or something. It's weird. Loch Ness Monster Cap. Cool item. Cool item. I I Billaboo. JJ. Hmm. I could go for JJ. Plus I did a 100k rap room like a cool boy. Grab our little save the trading system thing. I'm gonna walk around like a Super Saiyan with our little Oculus. Isn't that like the point of this to be like, you know, that over 9,000 thing? I'm pretty sure that's why this existed. <laughs> oh, hey, look, I actually found another Doom Bucket in game. Cool. I'm looking, I'm basically right now what I'm trying to do is find something that's good. Okay, let's see. I'm fourth richest in the server. That's how you know it's not a good server. So we are going to go to a new one. Red grind. This is my favorite item in the game. Messer and red grind have always been some of my favorite hats. All right, let's see here. All right, we're all the way at the bottom of the front page, and we're back down. <laughs> good. Q Liz. I'm sure I'll find a couple of doom buckets in here. Oh, this guy has the same shirt. No, he doesn't. This one has red grind texture. His doesn't. Does anyone have a doom bucket? No doom bucket. Okay, anyway. Spark time floor is good. I want that. XII Chris to J. What? Okay. <laughs> Let's see, is there anyone with anything we want? Valk is bad. Valk is bad. Why are you freaking out that he got Valk? It's a bad item. <laughs> Le Levian just like fell over. What a silly goose. Oh my god, you're rich. Who are you and why do you have a Frigidus? I literally never heard of you. How do you have a Frigidus? Whatever. Doom Bucket. Yeah. Doom Bucket. Okay, let's see here. We walked around one time. Void Star is a good item on our list of wishes. So we're gonna send Cynical Duke trade. Go over down to people. And we're gonna send him a trade for his Void Store. Void Star, we're gonna give Classic Fedora. And we're going to add... So I'm gonna value this as 65 because I'm biased. I'm gonna value this as 75. So I'll add this. And this, then he'll need to add, right? Right? How do I do math? I don't know what math is. <laughs> 65 plus 6 plus 6. 77. Alright. If I remove this and put in Tick Explosion and this, that would be fine, I guess. Trade outbound. So let's do this. Doing the math, that's 75 if you count CF as 65. Probably isn't 65. That's okay though. Send me trades. I want this. Why do people do that stuff? That's weird. Venusi. Yeah, like, I, I don't know who you are. I don't know how you have referred to this. That's really weird. I thought I knew people who own, like, you know, those OG Dominuses and whatnot. But I honestly have no clue. Oh, this Trade guy has a domino- Way to kill my vibe, man. Hey, this guy has a domino crown and red grind. Two really good items that are old. That I probably will never get again. Or again, b meaning red grind, not domino. I never had domino. 
I remember a time when Red Grind was like 600 oh dear demand. Like, you could not get that thing. Because nobody wanted to trade it. Always got really good offers back then. Rip. Cor Quaker Stakes. Cool name. Dwizzy. Let's see here. I kind of want Clockworks headphones, but they're lowering. Despair Warrior. What's Bucket like? Maybe 9? 8.5? Something like that? Ah, oh, ew. Peacemaker. Ew. Clockworks headphones. Ew. This guy has bad stuff. Oh, Arctic Commando's good. It's a beautiful item. Flexen. Crowda. These are some rich people that I've seen on Elmad like four times. Let's see here. Threes. Does anyone here have stuff that are good that I want? <laughs> Anything I don't want is bad to me. And I don't even know what I want. It's new server. Go into full screen again. Alright, this one isn't going to be as good. Because I'm right around the middle on the wrap. Arcanicus. Oh, I thought that said 1.2 million. I'm like, whoa, did he get scanned? DHR1. Cool stuff, cool stuff. Pink Emperor. DCXY. Wait, I didn't click on your name there. Oh, you don't really have anything I want either. No one has anything I want. Hockey mask, maybe, if it goes down. I don't want it. People say it's trash. Well, that's why I'm giving neon green for legit, because I don't want it. It's trash. Denaxius. Oh, I know this guy. This guy had a lot. I don't know what happened to him. He had like 400. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I'm thinking of someone else. I'm thinking of someone else. This guy is prankster, though. We could get pranks there, right guys? We could get anything! But he has an AFK bot, so we're not trading with him. AFK bot people are bad. Hey! Are you hoarding legit and neon green? Let's just ask him because I feel like he probably is. Oh. Well, he has a lot of them. I thought he might be. But, okay. Yeah, you know what? Okay. I bazo. I do want Rainbow Fedora, but I don't think it's going to do well. So let's just go into a trade offer and look at the item. See if I can make him add anything that would make it a little bit worth it. Maybe if he adds legit, I could put legit. <laughs> That stuff is stupid. Oh yeah, you gave your same item for my same item. And suddenly it's worth it. <laughs> okay, um... Oh, I forgot I upgraded! These two don't 1v1, and I don't have anything that can add up to that without making him mad. Knight of the Trashy Nibis. So... We're kinda stuck in a hole now. Cause the big items, I don't want to trade. And for the small items, I really can't add up to anything big right now. But in between now and next episode, I should probably upgrade these. Xeno targeting, I'm willing to get rid of. It's okay. But I'm going to trade everything May Day and down right now. So top four, I'm going to leave not for trade. Or you know what? I'll leave them open. But I'm mainly focusing on May Day down to trade and upgrade on. Oh, it's 2014, not 2012. My bad, guys. But, um, if you don't understand what I mean, I mean, I said Mayday 2012 at the beginning, I remember. But, um, yeah, anyway, Mayday 2014 and down, I'm trading all that. Um, I'm gonna upgrade in between now and ex next episode, as I've said. But that's pretty much it, guys. I'll see you guys next time, and goodbye.